Hello, brothers and sisters. I'm like, welcome, 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 welcome to my face. Check in, welcome, 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 Any comments, questions, or answers, you put it down below. I have something else to talk about. I'm going to try to keep this short because um, I know I made the video before. I wear my glasses so that I have to be real fast and, and, and meticulous. Okay. And of course, I'm being very sharp. Um, yeah? Is there a problem? No. What are you looking at? So you make noise. Okay. Don't look at me. Now, if you have comments, questions, or suggestions, or insults, you put it down below. I monitor screamers and approve of it. If it's corny, I'm just going to delete it. If you have any questions, I'll just basically try to make a video of it. And bygones be bygones. Because we all are the same. We are all the same gods. This wall is a god. Everything behind me is god. It's all energy. Okay? You can speculate all you want. It's a waste of time and energy. It's, it's theoretical. Now, this video is going to be about... If you don't know me by now, let's look at all your asses off the page and go look at some other. Look at look at, look, at, look at something else. Okay, look at my other videos. Okay, you're boring. Okay, don't subscribe if you don't if you don't like oral sex. Okay, <laughs> right? <laughs> I know, the, the voice told me that said either oral. I said oral. What the fuck? I'm thinking subconsciously like what the fuck? Why you say that? That's why I said crazy. Oral sex. Hey, what? What's the shut up? Shut the fuck up. No, Oreo sex. No, this ain't being Oreo sex. Oreos. You know Oreos? You keep getting your teeth messed up. Oreo. Okay. Uh -huh. Oreos. Right. Yeah, you know what I'm talking about. You ate my cookies. You little bastard. I told you don't listen to mom when God gives you cookies. No, you're already stupid. No, you're stupid because that's why your teeth hurts. That you want your teeth to hurt? Don't eat my cookies. Now. Um, now, if you you have any comments, questions, or answers, you put it down below. Now, this video is going to be about black men dating white women. Okay, I'm gonna call it straight up an illusion. It's a fucking illusion, man. Fact one: Watch the TV program called Snapped, and look how many cracker women kill white men. Okay. okay, it comes on late at night though. Like, like they don't want you to know about this shit. Okay, I, I thought the white man was like supreme in intellectualism when it comes down to handling women, but they did. They did have their time in the the Stonehenge times, the imperialistic kings of Arthur and shit like that. They had mistresses and shit, and if the wife didn't produce a child, then the, the king can have another wife or some shit like that. And he had a bastard child on the side. Okay, I, I understand the old era, the dark ages, dark age times. Okay. But that's why religion was created. Okay, so the white men don't want people sharing and have multiple wives. So that's why we got religion. And the people don't understand the origins of, of paganism and all that Roman Greek Hellenization type shit. So I'm not going to go down this list here. I'm saying talk about the illusion here. Now, as I dated white women, I realized that there was peace of mind. They gave me peace of mind. But as I said before, there's differences between fucking a white woman versus a black woman. And though it is more entertaining to be with a white woman because she's more docile into your needs sexually, of course, you know, white women love more the bestiality than anything, okay, than black women. Because black women are down to earth and they just want the dick, okay, and, and pussy money weed type shit, okay. But black, white women are copying, trying to copy and taking the attributes from black women. But the illusion comes from is where... These particular men, I, I'm, I'm confused. Muslim men, I even talk to them because I'm and I get confused. I'm like, okay, you, no black man, no black Muslim dates white women. Okay, that's the devil. They don't date the devil. That's their belief system. But I, 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 I've dated white women, but the reason why I won't date them because they age faster. Okay, and their hair fall out a little faster. It's a genetic thing. Okay, and and if I do see a. a a uh, mixed red bone or some shit like that. Then that's still not as attractive as a darker skin chick. Because who wouldn't love some fucking Neapolitan ice cream? I don't. You just want uh, 
vanilla and chocolate, okay? You just want vanilla and chocolate? You just want vanilla and chocolate? Okay, no, no, vanilla, I'm, I'm so sorry. Vanilla and strawberry? That's all you want? Vanilla and strawberry? Okay. Now, now if you're black, this may be attractive for a while, but as time progresses, I've seen women who just age. I've seen, I remember this girl I used to talk to. Let me tell you something here. And, um, say, uh, the Sarah girl I used to talk to. Yeah. And, you know, I would call them the golden bush. And then I realized that there's certain attributes about a woman, a white woman, okay, who basically tends to fall apart. Okay. Though their minds could be set. I've talked to a lot, countless white women. I get along with them perfectly fine. I don't see nothing wrong, okay, with the little... Uh, the Tootsie Roll and you know, vanilla and chocolate, okay, you know, some chocolate and their vanilla, okay, there's nothing wrong with that. I have no quarrels against white women, okay. But then I realized something, okay, if they do not have an attitude, what do the fuck they have? So I started doing some research and I found out that about the TV program called Snapped and shit like that. And I started to do some algorithms here and there all across the world. And I see a lot of white men getting snapped up, snapped. Okay, watch the TV program so snap. You know, if you want to clear everything up, you know, the white women are more dangerous. Milano to white women are far more dangerous than black women. Because all you get with a black woman, this is the truth. This is from me. And I'm called a player and a fucking paper. And I'm not those things. From my experience with black women, they don't really cause a lot of hectic. It's mainly about money and dick. Okay. While a white woman, it's mainly about more money okay, and attention. It's like everything else on top of that because they're think they're planning, they're keeping their motherfucking mouth shut for the right opportunity and time for you to fuck up. What happened? All right, white women are far more nastier than black women. All right, it's a fucking fact. And even though statistics you see right there, you see white women will cause more crime than black women because there's more white women than black women. So you take statistically, you take the 5% of those white black women versus the fucking 30% of white caucasoid women. You really think they're going to get, it's going to get out there in the media? Watch the TV program called Snap. Watch a lot of these uh, forensics, uh, TV, television. Shut up. Shut up. I'm making a video, baby. What's the matter? Her teeth? What did I tell you? See, my magic has just revealed itself on TV. And I told her about talking to me about my Oreo cookies. And we were talking about oral sex. So Oro is actually Oreo, right? So it's not oral sex she's gonna be taught about. She's it's it's about respect. Okay. So if these illusion these men are basically these black men are going towards these white sisters, that's an illusion. Because look at OJ. Look what he had to do. He had to he probably paid someone to kill the bitch. Okay, I don't I don't condone. I I've met countless white women that I got along with. And I didn't have a problem with white women. It's just that I can't be with them, like, because they wasn't virgins. That's number one. Number two, number two, they age faster. Okay, and number three, they always have some kind of material. It's, it's like, if everything is going perfectly with this 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 white sister, this snow queen, don't you think she has something in store for you? What, women should be like this overall to the top of the team. If they don't believe in polygyny, and they don't, they, they shouldn't be a whore. They should just accept it, okay? Now I, I did tell I talked to some women who were with some pimps, some temp, pimp type type guys, and they stayed with the man regardless. But that don't make them a fool. They love that man, and that man's still taking care of them. Okay, and blah blah blah. But men will cheat when they do not have the, the you know the proper respect. It's mainly respect, not just about sex. Now the lower forty percent men, it's about sex. Okay, All right. So we got that out of the way because I don't want you to put that. On the good men, because the good men, they don't care. They just try their best to work with you. Because I don't deal with non, I, I don't deal with non-virgins, okay? I deal with virgins, okay? And if you're not a virgin, then I can't control you. I can't, I have nothing, no use for you, because I, I think you're going to cheat. I don't know your history. If one dick got up in you, I, and I know how white women are. They're more nasty or more creative than black women. That's, a, that's one reason why a lot of these lowly men, black men, will gravitate towards white women, okay? Because they are more docile. Do you understand? They're more docile, more nice, and respectable. But that's the dead end street if they fuck up. Okay? A men have a right to kind of fuck up if they just be honest and open about it. They be telling you, if you just tell a woman in advance, if you do this, I'm going to do this. Okay? That puts a little bit of fear in her heart. That makes her think. But most men don't do this. They're cowards. 
I'm talking about men overall in general, not just black men, okay? Technically, I've talked to countless black men and white men and mulatto and Hispanics. And I learned something. I know there's a fucking pattern with this shit. If I see a black man with a white sister, either his fucking penis is fucking small. <laughs> wait, wait. Are they like the Asian man? Or probably they don't have they don't have a good conversation. They're weak. They don't have confidence with themselves. Do it. That's two. Either because they got hurt by a lot of black women. All right. Okay. Or they did some algorithm on different personalities. They into psychology. But t- t- I'm just gonna tell you something straight, real hardcore shit right here. I don't see how you can date a red bone or a light sky, a light skinned mulatto. I don't I don't like them too much. Okay, me. I just have to go. That's why I said check the parents. I made a video about that shit. You'll start seeing patterns. So if you get your wife pregnant and she become like a horse or an elephant, that's going to take time to get that weight down. Right. So that's the reason why black men, I give you me to get a small penis. They may got a small penis. OK, maybe you have a fetish with white women because I like I said, Neopol- Neapolitan color, you know, that's the chocolate, vanilla and strawberry. OK, you have chocolate. And if you lay chocolate down and you open up, you get strawberry. And then if you stick your penis, your Tootsie Roll in there, your New York style, 80 style, <laughs> 80 style dick in there, you get vanilla. OK, so that's Neapolitan. Now, if, if you take away the chocolate, you just get fucking vanilla and strawberry. Okay? <laughs> and, 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 and guys who are just fascinated with just cream okay, and just strawberry, OK? That's not enough, okay? It has to go exotic, okay? And that's my point. I have a, I have a, I have a Facebook page called, um, and to prove my point, okay? You know, the white man has uh, uh, enslaved countless black women in the past, okay, through slavery, and, and it, they cheat on them. They cheat with the... You ever seen Harlem Nights? You ever seen that scene where uh, that man was like, oh, she, uh, bonafide pussy? He was like, oh, my goodness, you know, so I'm leaving my wife, I'm leaving my fucking wife because she's so attractive and so beautiful. It doesn't mean that the white woman is not good in bed, okay? It's just the the beauty aspect of it, okay? There's a I already told you in the past that white people are jealous of the color, okay? All right, and, and certain features on the black woman, okay? I, I've said this in the past countless times. It's symmetrical. It's just, it's just all written throughout history, okay? If you want to get down to it, okay? Hey, stop that fucking thing. Turn that thing off. Get that thing on it. Get that thing out of there. Pull it out. If it's a hundred percent. I've learned this by studying. Okay, you don't know what the fuck you're talking about, so don't try to compete against me. When does turn it off? I'll pull it for you. Against what white men desire in the black woman? Don't do it. Don't 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 come that shit with me. I I I will show you proof of what I'm talking about here. And if you try to, usually if you take you take those points, those valid points that I give you, and you say that's wrong, and then I just told you, I just it's clear as day, the white man had black women in slavery. Jamaica, Barbados, Trinidad, Haitian. Okay, they love them. Okay, I see them over there in Ethiopia. At Maya Hotel Resort. They making porn and shit. Though, you can't see cream as bright on a pink penis or a white caucasoid penis. Right? I'd rather watch black porn. Okay, it's more exotic. Now, I, I know I'm kind of like yellow skin, but my color changes. I get dark skin when I go out in the sun. So I know I'm a nigga, okay? <laughs> But you got to understand something here. I'm not, my screen is fucking shaking a little bit. You got to understand something. Black women are more exotic. Okay? And if you can't find a black sister, they will most likely gravitate towards white sisters. But if they marry a white sister, that's a simp motherfucker right there. Look at Tiger Woods. Look at all of the guys that got in trouble through the law. With white sisters and the yellow Milano sisters. I got in trouble... By a girl uh, in, my, in my past, okay? And I called the cops, and I got in deep shit for that shit. I, I believe that if if she was black, they probably would let it go, threw the case away. But, of course, if she was light-skinned, Milano, she had a lot of hair, more hair, more hair than my fucking wife. She stood taller than me, too. Okay. But um, I got in trouble for that shit, but they, they, had, they had blessed me now, okay? So when I get in trouble, I get blessings. It's kind of weird how this world works for me, okay? But, of course, that's all I want to say, brothers and sisters of light. I said a lot of information there. And um, I hope you understand that why black men date white sisters. It's an illusion. They're not going to, if they're good men, then they'll probably have an old, decrepit old white woman when they hit the age of 60 or even 50. While the, he's starting to shine. Okay, black men don't age as much. If he's black, he's not going to shine. His face is not going to age as much. And that's going to be a problem. 
That's gonna be a problem when they get older. Shut that shit up. Shut it up. Why are you messing with her phone? Well, she shouldn't have been talking to me. Listen to my magic if you want to know what magic is. Rinse your mouth. Go brush your teeth right now. I did. Go, 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 go. Brush your teeth. Please understand. Once you go black, you don't go back. Okay. Blacks don't crack. Okay. Unless you're white, like crack. That's it. That rhymed. Blacks don't crack, but once you're white, you crack. But if you crack, you go, you white. Okay. <laughs> I know that sounds racist. No, it's not racist. I'm just a comedian, motherfucker. Don't don't get mad at me. This is this is a facts, okay? I'm glad I'm black. Black, poor, and proud, okay? I'd rather not be fucking rich, you okay? know. If I was rich, I would give to all those who are need. I'm a missionary. I've done a lot of missionary work, okay? I had to start my own fucking church, right? Right? But since I'm making these videos a little longer for y'all, okay? Um, thank you very much, okay, for giving me attention, okay? I don't really need it, but I, I just want to talk about my life on YouTube, okay? And I'd be happy to oblige to make you happy like motherfuckers, okay? <laughs> I can make a whole bunch of noise if my daughter don't wake up. I just, I, I'm going to put her over there. She's getting on my nerve now. I want the baby to cry. I want her to cry, and she don't cry, okay? Peace and love to you, brothers and sisters. Like, dog. What else is it to say about why black people, why black guys, attractive guys, will go with white, white sisters and Milano's? And eventually get themselves in trouble with that. What else is there to say? I talked about Bill Cosby. I spoke about um, Tiger Woods. I even talked about Michael Jordan. And, 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 and a lot of different individuals who basically get themselves in trouble because of Milano and fucking white chip, white sisters and shit. They're, they're better. They're definitely better in bed than the black sisters. That's a fact. I say, I got to get white sisters that, okay? But there's a time limit on there. They're compelling this, okay? <laughs> I th that's why I say it's date your own kind, date your own type. If you date your own type, you won't have that problem. Just like me, my wife is my type. Okay, but my beauty tends to shine higher than hers, and her beauty tends to shine. <laughs> her beauty tends to shine higher than mine at certain times. I don't know what it is. Sometimes I look more attractive than my wife, and people be like, "What the fuck is that? What do you? What do you? Do? How do you get her? Where'd she come from? She don't look like she's from America." I said, "How the fuck do you know?" You're a smart motherfucker for saying that. But look at me. I look like an ugly motherfucking uh, hobo. Not a hobo. Yeah, a, a hobo. I look like a hobo sometimes. And she looks too beautiful. So I can't, I, can't, I can't hang out with her. I can't hang out with her because she looks too beautiful. Her hair be too far out. I said, you, you, you look too attractive. You have to balance it down. Cut it down. Because people will look at me and say, oh, she's too beautiful for you. I'm not stupid. I'm not, I'd rather look nice. I'd, I'd rather be matching like Jada Pickett and Will Smith. They both matching individuals, right? Fall for your type, motherfuckers. Now, okay, what else is to say about why blacks go dating white sisters? I'm not going to talk about this no more. I made this video many times before. White women are more dangerous, by fact, than by far. All right? Now, if you go to another country, black women's exorcists are a little bit more um, toned down by leaving the country. But don't bring the bitches in here, okay? Don't bring them black sisters in, them, in America. <laughs> My wife acts up, but I I had plans for that shit, so. I got backup plans. Uh, cover your ass, okay? Peace.